It's hugging the coast of South Carolina. So it's going to zip across southern Georgia overnight into South Carolina. And then by tomorrow evening at 7 o'clock, it's all the, way, all the way out here in the central Atlantic. So the fact that it's moving so quickly means that it, there will be heavy rain. There will be some gusty winds around 40 to 50 miles an hour. But no catastrophic flooding is expected across the coast of Carolina, of the Carolinas, Georgia, or even Florida tonight. And then later this week, look at this, on Wednesday, it's all the way up into southeast Canada. Cold front's going to sweep this thing out rather rapidly, so this will be a distant memory here in just a day or two. Tuesday's forecast here in North Texas, much quieter, no heavy rain, no tropical atmosphere. Even the air is relatively dry. Temperatures in the mid-60s tomorrow morning will make it up to 90, 91 degrees tomorrow afternoon. We'll have an east wind tomorrow, but what begins to happen, as usually is the case here, the winds go back out of the south. On Wednesday, they're still just enough out of the east that I think we'll squeeze out one more relatively comfortable day with drier air on Wednesday. By the time we get to Thursday, though, that south wind really begins to take over. It becomes more humid on Thursday, still warm, if not hot. Highs in the lower 90s. I think